Hey, I'm excited to share some new updates to the Resume Builder with you. We've been working very, very hard to bring some of our original ideas more to the forefront with the Resume Builder. So let me just go ahead and dive in and show you. So core to the idea of the Resume Builder is the ability to manage multiple resumes, but have them be aware of each other and be able to push data back from one to the other. So here we've got three resumes, resume A, B, and C. All right, another thing I wanna call out is there used to be a career history here. If you're new to Teal, you never saw it. If you used to use it Teal before, there was, there was this work history, it's now gone. Uh, so it's important that you notice that, but it's gonna be much better now. All right, so let's dive into resume A. And here is the typical Teal resume as you know it. And before, if you made changes to this resume, they were stored on this resume only. You'd have to go over to the work history, edit there, and then push it out. Now, you can make changes and you can choose to make changes just to this resume or to have it broadcast out to other res resumes. So let's just see a very simple, basic example. Say I did want to add my Twitter handle here. I'll say at Tina. And I'm just gonna do it just on this one resume for this one company. I'm gonna go ahead and save that. All right, let's go back over and now look at resume B. And it's gonna say there's updates available. And that means there's updates in Teal, but they're not on this resume, right? See, the Twitter handle is empty. So if I say updates available, it's now gonna show me what's on here and what's possible to pull in. And so I'm gonna go ahead and say, save updated, and there it is, right there. So now I've got Tina on this resume. So that's how you pull information in from any resume, which is super cool. Now let's go ahead and make some other changes. So in this case, we want to edit this professional summary. And I'll just do something simple so we see it. This is a change. And what you can do now is you can check here and say save to all resumes. And when you save this, it's now gonna be on all your other resumes. So let's go back over to resume C. And this is a change. See, it's on all resumes. In this particular case, we didn't actually pull in the Twitter handle, so we could if we wanted to here, right? So now I'm gonna say, you know what? Let me go ahead and just say, at Tina, hit save to all resumes, and now publish that out. Right, so now you have much more control of what you can write and save just on one particular resume or what you can push out to all your resumes. So let's just you do one more example. Say on this particular resume, you know, I didn't, I don't wanna talk about boosting brand awareness. I wanna talk about boosted revenue, right? And I only wanna change it for this one resume because it's a better match on this particular job. So I can save it. And now on this particular resume, it's here and it did not affect my other resumes. So let's go here, it's still brand awareness. Now there's an update available. If I wanted to import it, I could, or I can just leave it, right? Which is really gonna make it easy for you to manage various versions of your resume, but still have Teal manage your overall career history so you can put everything you ever wanted. And what we're really trying to do is create a paradigm where you can create and curate. And so you can have everything you've ever done. You don't need to hide parts of yourself or the things that you've achieved. Now you can create this exhaustive career history and just show that 10% of you that is 100% relevant to the company you're applying to. All right, so that same concept applies all the way down. Uh, whenever you make a new resume, it's going to pull the latest version, uh, even of any edits. So it's always going to pull the most recent version of any changes you made. So it's really easy to make more resumes and make changes. So it works on the entire resume builder. We've got a whole bunch of other really cool things coming. But the main things to know are what used to be the work history where you need to make changes and broadcast it out to all your resumes, that's now gone. It is embedded in every single resume and from any resume, you can pull in changes or you can push out changes. All right, we hope you love it. Uh, we're really excited for you to use it uh, and give us feedback. Always hit that little uh, exclamation mark in the lower right or send us an email at hello at tlhq.com. We want to make it as easy and exciting and fun as possible for you to present your best self, all right? So please 
Let us know, and we hope you love this new release of the Resume Builder.